What's up Summit Kids, Pastor Dylan here and welcome to yet another video. Hey, you guys, you've been asking for it. You've been asking for it. You said, Pastor Dylan, can you record some more Roblox? And I'm like, yeah, 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 we'll do it. We'll make it happen. And then guess what? I haven't made it happen. <laughs> I've been playing some games outside of Roblox, but you know what, guys? I've been wanting to get back to it because we have a lot to do. We have a lot to accomplish in some of the games on Roblox. And today, specifically, we need to hit up some more of Roblox uh, Bloxburg. We gotta get some more things happening in our life. We gotta get our furniture. We gotta get our walls painted. We gotta do whatever we can do. So we're gonna do that today. It's gonna be awesome. I'm excited that you're here for the journey. So let's go ahead. Let's dive in to my, or, or well, not my. I'm, I'm trying to go back to my restaurant. We, <laughs> we'll be back to that eventually. But right now it is Bloxburg. So let's hit it up. Alrighty, well here we are. We are loaded back in to Bloxburg and we've got $100 right off the bat. Let's go. We be rolling in that dough. Come on somebody. Alright, let's hop in the house. It looks like it's nighttime. Oh look guys, that guy that was standing out here is gone. Praise God. That's good, that's good. Alright, let's uh, oh that's the bathroom. Wait, oh yeah, I got needs don't I? Oh, you need to have some fun. All right. Oh, gosh. Here we go. Let's watch the informative news. <laughs> okay, anyway, that's enough. Turn it off. Wait, change channel? Okay, okay. I, I actually... Okay, let's do that. Oh, have a seat. Have a... Have, Sit, 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 boy, sit. Okay, he's. Uh, okay, finally. That. Do you guys see this? That person is cooking in slow motion, <laughs> and just like, it's like they got the cutting board and they're okay. Yep, it's just. This is our TV show right here today. How to cook. So informative. <laughs> That's literally all it is. So the news channel is and then cooking channel is just nothing. Okay. All right. Get up. Whoa. Do you guys get out of, up out of your chair like that? So he was sitting like this and then he just immediately, well, he was, he was sitting like this and he was just like, <laughs> okay. Oh, let's, let's do that again. He was sitting there and he was sitting like this, but when he stood up, he immediately was like, <laughs> okay. Anyways, enough fooling around. Oh, we are blurry. <laughs> okay. Here we go. All right, now we're talking. All right, um, so I like the music. Uh, I can, let's let's see what other channels are. Maybe there's something else good here. <gasps> okay, you guys hear this? It's just a rainbow unicorn flying in the clouds. Pretty special. All right, oh, oh he did it again. <laughs> That's so odd. Okay, change the channel. Okay, boost mood. Oh, okay, that's that cost that costs money. All right, so we got a fire. We got a we got a fireplace now, y'all. All right. Uh, why is there pizza out on the counter? Can we like clean that up? That's just that. P Who knows how long that pizza has been sitting out there? That's probably disgusting. Like, okay. Anyways, do we we don't actually need to eat right now? Let's uh, oop. Let's go into the oop. All right, we need to get our hygiene boosted. So let's take a quick uh, shower here. So, so as he showers, I'm going to take this moment to tell you boys and girls what our verse of the day is because the Bible has 
important information for us. It has, it, again, I mentioned in one of our previous videos, that it is the map to the adventure that God has for our life. And so we got to see what our verse of the day is because it's so important because the Word of God also has promises for us that we can walk in. It's it's such an awesome thing. The Bible is so awesome. I challenge you to dive into it and read it. But let's go ahead and see. Our verse of the day today is found in Psalm chapter 56, uh, verse 3. And it says, When I'm afraid... I will put my trust in you. Now the question is, who is you? Who is, what is this verse talking about? When it says, I will put my trust in you, who should we put our trust in when we're afraid? What do you think? Now, we can put our trust in people, but the number one person, the number one uh, thing that we should put our trust in is in God, is in His Word. Because you see, there's promises like I just talked about that we can stand on. In fact, the Bible says that we weren't created with a spirit of fear, that we don't have to be afraid because we trust a good God who is bigger than anything that we face. And so whenever you're afraid, just like this verse says, put your trust in God, put your trust in Him because He is the one who's gonna help you through this. He is the one that you can depend on and He is the one who will be with you every step of the way. And so with that being said, I think we're done with our shower. So let's hop right back on over. So, awesome. What an awesome segue. I didn't even know I was going to do that. It was spontaneous. It was in the moment. And I think it turned out great. What do you guys think? Yeah. It was awesome. Oh, I was like, what is that cracking? And I was like, oh yeah, that's right. I got a, I got a fire on the TV. All right, let's see. Let's change the channel. Let's see what else we got. Oh no, we definitely don't want to watch the news. No, thank you. All right, what are our needs? Oh, I'm hungry. I'm hungry. Okay, let's eat some food. Why did I say it like that? I don't know. All right, uh, apple, grapes, banana, carrot, grape juice, milk, water. Water's free, but everything else costs money. Pear, cereal, baby bottle. Why would I want that? Uh, toast, toast. You know what? It's morning. It's breakfast. Let's let's have us some cereal. What? I have a question. When you eat cereal for breakfast, do you grab a cutting board and put the bread or the br Yeah, you put bread in your cereal? No, do you? <laughs> Why am I saying it like Guys, I, I might need you to pray for me. But here's the question I have. Okay, whenever you make cereal in the morning, or, yeah. Whenever you eat breakfast and you're eating cereal, do you grab a cutting board with the box and the milk and the bowl on top of it? Like, and he's only holding it with one hand, so he's obviously a strong guy. Let me tell you what. All right, so do I have to? I have to mix it on the counter. Ooh, where? What is that brown powder? That looks a bit concerning. Is that stink gas? I don't know. Yeah! I hope it's not stink gas, cause that would be nasty. S. What was that? It was like, dunk. Huh? Did you guys hear that? Hey, I learned a new skill. I learned how to cook. Yeah. Wait. Making cereal teaches you how to cook. All right, boys and girls. I have a wisdom nugget for you today. Start eating cereal for breakfast because then you will gain skill in cooking. Apparently, according to this game. Oh, he's, you got your thumb, you got your finger in the uh, cereal there, bub. All right, uh, let's, let's have a seat. Play, oh, we got to place the cereal. Place, interact, eat. Oh, I was, I thought he was going to sit down, but I guess not. I guess not. Oh, now we got a dirty dish. All right, uh, let's wash it. Water balloon. Okay, you got to, we got to hold up just a second. Let's wash this. Let's. Let's get our responsibilities taken care of, and then we're going to see what this water balloon does, okay? It's going to be awesome. Man. All right, we finished? All right, awesome. All right, take water balloon. All right, what do I do with this water balloon? Can I throw it at this tree? Throw. What was that? Did you guys see that? He was like, oh, he like he didn't even really throw it. What? Come on. Hey, look, there's somebody else over there. 
Their house looks pretty cool. Can we come check it out? Howdy, neighbor. How's it going? Taco. Oh, taco. What's up, taco? Can I, how do I knock on your... What just happened to the house? What? What just happened? It like disappeared and turned into a for sale sign. Okay. Um, alrighty then. Whoa, look at this place. That looks amazing. Like, do you guys see? Look, they're like jumping back there. What's up? This, this place is amazing. Look at this. It's beautiful. Uh, uh, rare, premium, uh, <laughs> Master. uh, oh, uh, did you guys see the way, that was kind of creepy, uh, we're just gonna pretend like that didn't happen, okay, what is this, what is this, is this somebody else's house, bakery sweets, nice, all right, well, we need to, we need to get focused here, like, we are already, what? We're already 10 minutes into this video and I have yet to accomplish anything <laughs> other than I washed the dishes and I ate some breakfast. So our fun's getting down again. So that's not good. But here's what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to go in here. Uh, what are we going to do? Uh, we should we should probably go to work. We should probably get some moolah, moolah so that we can uh, customize our house some more. And actually, maybe we could actually paint the outside or something. Maybe that would be where we start. I don't know. All right, uh, let's see. Work. So we're a level two as a pizza baker. We haven't done a cashier yet. Let's let's try that. Go to work, go to work, go to work, work, work. Oh yeah, right there. Cashier, let's try it out. Loading. Patiently waiting. Okay, so this is taking a hot minute. So let's see. What is the fruit of the spirit that we need here? Correct. It was patience. All right. Uh, wow, look at this uniform. Oh, my. Okay. Uh, oh, hi. I'd like burger and drink. I don't know what that is. That looks like root beer. How do I do this? All right, so let's see. Do I just, do I just click that? Oh! Yeah! Okay, that's easy. Easy enough, so we just click and we go bang. Man, this is an easy job compared to the other ones, I feel like. Looks delicious, thank you. I heart video games, nice shirt, man. Hey, we got promoted again. That was quick. Yeah, this job I feel like is so much easier than the other ones. Like, holy moly. Now, the question is, does the money match that? Okay, so let's do this. How do I leave again? Do I just walk out? Okay, that's probably not the best way to do it. $206 to D Dilly 116 working as a cashier. Well, thank you very, very much. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm going to click down here and I'm gonna go to house. We're gonna go home and we're gonna see if we can afford anything. My guess is probably not. However, it's worth a shot, it's worth a try. And if we can get something that would be amazing. All right, so it looks like we gotta wait for the loading screen. All right, so build mode, let's do it. All right, we got the fancy tunes, build. All right, decorate. Um, is there anything for walls? Can I like, stairs, wall trim. 
floor, doors, basements, fence gate, garden, trash, windows, all. Fences, basic shapes. How do you change the wall? There's gotta be a way I can change like the siding or something, right? New. So this, you can add a lawnmower, $14,000. Oh my goodness, that is expensive. All right, so I'm gonna guess it's under decorations. Uh, lighting, tables, training, plumbing, pool items, vehicles, instruments, households, curtains, carpets, appliances, block books. Oh, that like, it costs that. Okay, new beds, comfort, electronics, lighting, tables, training. Where's like wall decoration? Oh, decorations. Decorats, decorations. All right, so we'll get rid of the welcome. Well, neighborly. Well, we want people to feel welcome when they come up. So I guess we'll keep it. All right, so let's see. Wait, that pizza box is a decoration? You mean I can clean my counter? Oh, <gasps> yes. How do I get rid of it? To the trash. Nope. Oh, hey, and it sells it. Very nice. Wait a second, what is this? Click to paint. <gasps> what? All right, let's 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 try it out, y'all. Let's see what happens. Can we do like a white? I don't think it's doing it. Okay, I bought something. Or I got, what? Okay, I am struggling here. All right, guys, we're gonna figure this out. Here's what we're gonna do. Move, click, paint. What color did I even choose? I can't even remember. That's not it. Uh, was it this one? Too dark. That one. Oh man, this is requiring some effort here. Can I like clean this one? I somehow did it to the inside earlier. I'm not sure how I did it. Y'all, this is a lot of work. This ain't no joke. That's a bright red, a burgundy. Uh, Y'all, this is taking so much focus. I'm just like, oh. All right, here we go. Bang. Bang. Thing. So we haven't quite figured out how to change the material. However, we at least figure out how to paint it. Give it our own little personal touch, you know. All right, so we'll do the, which red did I do? Was it that one? So, terracotta, terracotta. Uh, okay. All right, terracotta. We got the red brick, and can we do something to the roof? Can we make it really black? I don't know if I like the really black though. What if we did terracotta with it too? Eh, I'm not a big fan. Let's do this. Let's go with whatever color that is. That looks like a roof color. All right, well, we're, why is it nighttime already? <gasps> we have to feel like we just got the day started. Well, I did work a long time at work, so. All right, so now what we gotta do is we gotta is there something in my inventory? Build, decorate. All right, let's, how do I get, yeah, there we go, okay. Oof, oof. Um, man, this is gonna take some work, y'all. Um, 
can I? How much does how much does build decorate appliances? How much would a new TV cost? Is the question. Or can we afford a vehicle? We can get a scooter or a bike. Um, electronics. Old television. Oh, you can get a computer too. Oh, look at this TV. All right, let's put it right here. We probably need some type of table to, it, uh, to put it on. Or actually, you know what? I bet I can reuse that one. Uh, how do I grab it? How do I get out of cell? Oh. Uh, build mode. There we go. Scoop. All right, we just we just had a little bump in the road. We figured out. Oh, I'm leaning a little too far forward. Scoop. All right, let's take our TV here. Let's. Yeah, look at that. We got the flat screen now, y'all. This is awesome. All right, is it? Oh, is it? Is there a way that I can decorate the wall? How did I even do that before? Honestly, I can't remember. Do you guys remember how I did that? Was it over here? It was that, okay. What? Was it that? Oh no, it was this one. How do I change? How do I, how, how do I, how do I, how, how do I, how, how do I, how, how do I, how, how do I, it's always a game of figuring it out y'all. How do I change what the wall is? Cause what if I want it to be all plain wall instead of this like click to paint, move select, shift and click to quick paint. Um Guys, I don't know if there is a way I can like Alright, what if we did like a What if we did like blue? That's a little too dark. Uh, like yeah, I like that, I like that, I like that. Shift click to quick paint. Oh, oh look, guys, we figuring it out. We are officially becoming professionals at this game. Let me tell you. Oh, oh, oh. All right, so let's go ahead. You know what? Let's just let's do the whole entire room is that everything Ooh, okay all right so we got oh we got that how do i what if i want to make the wood flooring into like carpet instead though you know the world may never know all right let's do this let's do a slightly brighter wood Hmm. I think that's darker. We'll go with that. Oh, for a second I thought it turned to blue. I was like, what? Alright, so we got wood floor in here that's a little different. Um... You know what? And there's a motorcycle going by or something. All right. Um. No. I guess we'll just leave these. A nice white tile floor for the kitchen. I think. Y'all, I'm not gonna lie. This is taking so much work. I think I'm gonna go ahead and. Uh, take a break from the build mode because ooh, 
That is exhausting, let me tell you what. That is so exhausting. In fact, I'm probably tired because it's late at night. Oh man, I need to have some fun. Uh, is there other, we can, let's read a book. Um, excuse me. Oh, I learned a new skill, intelligence. Oh, you see that guy's reading is so good for you. In fact, I need to do more reading myself, but man, you can learn a lot from reading. In fact, you know what you should really be reading? The most important thing to be reading? Your Bible. Come on, somebody. If you said it, that was awesome. Come on, let's let's get a yay for it. Yay! I was like, wait a second, it's hesitating. But there it is, yay! Yay for reading your Bible. It's so good for you. And now we're more intelligent. All right, uh, let's put that back. Oh, or not. Uh, how do I stop reading? See, look, you can have fun while reading too. Look at it going up there. That's awesome. All right. Uh, sleep. Can I do I sleep read? Oh, man. After all that hard work, I wouldn't mind sleeping right now either. Oh, uh, let's just take a quick nap, y'all. Let's just take a quick nap. Oh. oh. One eternity later. Okay. Oh. I feel like I could have actually fell asleep there if I wanted to. Okay. <laughs> All right. So we're a hundred percent energy. Now we gotta get some. We gotta get some food. We gotta get the goods. All right. Let's see. We gotta take a quick meal. Let's eat something different. Let's eat a carrot. Carrot. Eat. Very nice, very nice. All right, oh, we're still hungry. So uh, let's have a quick meal, let's have more. Wait, that's a quick meal. How do you take ingredients? Yeah, I was like, that means you probably have to be able to cook. Can we, <gasps> we can cook all kinds of stuff. Let's see. Bacon and eggs, let's go. I like me some bacon and eggs. All right, let's fry us up some eggs. Uh, Q. R. Ah, oh, look at this. Click. Oh, the flip. Q. I like how it like lets you uh, do the process here. This is awesome. I feel like I'm a part of the cooking. Uh, click. Oh, oh, you got a time limit. Okay, that's good to know. I like you can hear the sizzle too. Oh, click. Hey, we're we're just building our skills, y'all. Isn't this awesome? Uh, look at us go here. All right, let's get us some grub here. Let's. You must place it on a table or counter to eat. Okay. Oh, okay. Eat. Place this on a table. We're at a table. All right, well, how do I get, oh, how do I, how do I get up? How do I get up? How do I, oh, how do I get up? How do I, oh, oh, there we go. <laughs> that was a struggle bus. All right, uh, place bacon and eggs. Hey, there we go. Now sit, now interact, take. What? I'm sitting at the table with it. Okay, y'all, this is being very, very uh, difficult. Place bacon and eggs. Interact. Take portion. Oh, now somehow I have two of them. I have two bacon and eggs now. I took one and I turned it into two. What is going on here? Okay, I am so confused. Y'all, I am so confused. All right, can I eat this? I don't know what I did different, uh, but we'll, uh, yeah, that works. All right, let's wash that. Oh, we weren't done yet. <laughs> uh, not what I'm wanting to do. Wash the dishes. Yeah, there we go. 
Watching the dishes. <gasps> oh man, I, I'm serious, guys. I'm like tired. <laughs> After like that was, I was so intensely focused here. What is he doing? I was so intensely focused for that building in uh that was it was it was a lot. Wait, okay, so I gotta store clean dishes. Okay, that's new. All right, interact, take. Now, can I put the leftovers in here? Store bacon and eggs. There we go. Nice. And apparently there's four portions left. So maybe that's what it is. It's like I cooked a full meal for several people or several portions. And then you just eat one portion whenever you're hungry. All right. So our food and energy is full. We need to have some fun and we need to get our hygiene taken care of. So let's, let's take another shower real fast. All right. So boys and girls, I want to know. How's your day today? Are you having a good day? I'll tell you what, I'm having a great day. Because today is the day the Lord has made. And I'm rejoicing and being glad in it. Because our joy is our strength. So we should take joy in God. We should take joy in what He's given us. Think of some things to be thankful for today. That God has given to you. That He has brought into your life. And yeah, that's awesome. Alright. Let's get back to it here. Uh. Uh. Fun. We need to have fun. Is there like fun things to do outside of the house? Um, you can throw a party. Interesting. Mood, work, skills. How do I travel? There's a way to travel, isn't there? Travel! Whoa, that looks like a pretty awesome house. Is that supposed to say hotel? Hotel? Hoddle. Oh, I apparently can give him. Oh, I can't go in. There that person goes. I wish we had a vehicle. We will get there one day. It's going to take some time. Um, I guess let's... How did I go to work before? I can't, I can't even remember, honestly, guys. I'm like... I feel like I'm so confused. Work. So, I mean, I guess we can do that. Jeez, cashier, like, is so easy to level up and get things done. Like, look at that. We're at level three. Oh, there's a woodcutter job. Let's do that. Let's give that one a try next. So we got cashier, we got hairdresser, we got mechanic, pizza, delivery, fisherman, seller, and Ben's ice cream stalker, cashier, woodcutter. That's what we're doing today. All right, so uh, I, I, I can chop, I guess. Look at that big saw blade. Holy moly. What am I supposed to chop? Is it this? Nope. What am I supposed to chop, sir? Welcome. I want to become... Just grab a hatchet inside and start chopping the surrounding trees. Alright. So... Like these trees? Oh, well, it seems to be working. Uh, we're doing something, I think. It doesn't seem to be budging. Oh my gosh, that would hurt. Did you guys see that? That tree fell right on me. Holy moly. But apparently, we got it. It says board right now. Oh, I need to have some... Is chopping trees not fun? I thought it was fun. That's a pretty good job, guys. All right, there we go. That's the best way to do it because then that way we don't get hurt. <laughs> All right. Well, I chopped some trees down. I think I'm going to go ahead and call it a day there. $80. Not bad, not bad. 
All right, uh, let's see. What do we got around here? Is there anything we can just go explore? Can I go swimming? Hey, I can't go swimming. Oh man, I'm not even wearing swimming clothes either. <laughs> cool. All right, uh, let's go explore a little bit here. Let's let's see what is happening in Bloxburg. We got there's that burger place I worked at. Oh, it looks like there's a market up here, maybe. There's someone driving a car. I think we've been into Mike's Motors before. That sounds familiar. I still don't think I can afford a car. <laughs> One day. I honestly feel like, guys, the moneymaker seems to be this burger place right now. But I'm a little disappointed in the fact that there's trash on the ground. Can I clean it up? I'd like to... I'd like to help keep our city clean. All right, well, I guys, I guess we're gonna work in here for a few minutes since we're here. Might as well. Oh wow, look at that! We just immediately changed into the work outfit. Bang. Seven hundred and twenty dollar. All right, that's the income we're looking for. But man, did that take some time? That took a lot and lots and lots of time. All right, let's see. What do we got here? Fancy furniture, Pizza Planet. I think I've been to Pizza Planet before. Gas box. There's a gym. There's an alien time machine. That's what ATM stands for, right? No. <laughs> That's definitely not what it stands for. But what do we got over here? What's this building to my left? All right, we got a grocery store. Can I buy me some food because I'm hungry? Oh, it's trying to make me an employee here, but I just wanted to do that. Oh, it stores it in your fridge. Your fridge. But I'm hungry now. Uh, I guess we could go look at my needs. They're so bad right now. I'm tired and I Need to have some fun. Oh, there's a Bloxburg City Hall. Let's go check it out What's at the City Hall? I don't know But I'm gonna find out why I'm singing this. I don't know There's a mailbox in the front huh? Welcome to the City Hall Can I go through the doors? Oh, there's not really much to see or do in here, it looks like. That's all right. All right, well, I guess we better go home. Go home, go home. All right, so we remodeled the outside of our house. We redid uh, the living room a little bit, got us a new TV. The question is, did we get any new channels? Well, the news is still the same. <laughs> oh, that guy does not look happy. Do you see that? So it's just, it's the cooking channel of an angry guy going like. I mean, I, I guess that's, yep. <laughs> then of course, unicorn, fireplace, and the news. That's all we got. Um, actually, I, I probably need to watch some TV. Well, I guess we're reading a book. <laughs> I guess we're reading a book instead. That's not what I was trying to do. But we just need to get our fun up, so... Man, we're, oh, we're gonna like 
starve here in a minute if I don't get some food. So let's go over here. Let's view content. <laughs> let's take one of our bacon and eggs. Because we got to eat up those leftovers. Apparently we made a lot of it. So we got to eat it all up. Okay. Uh, view content. Let's take another one because he's real hungry. All right, and then let's, I guess we're closing that and turning that off. I want to read book. All right, so we can boost our fun here. Get it taken care of. Oh, we increased our intelligence some more. We're getting smarter, y'all. It's happening. It's happening. It's all good. Y'all, this is just, this is like, this game is work. <laughs> it is a lot, a lot to do, a lot to think about, a lot to endure. Um, that's just what it is. And why I talk like this, I don't know. Alright, so our fun is at 60%. Does it go up faster if I watch TV? I mean, that's not the best way to entertain ourselves, but... Oh yeah, look at that. That's like boosting our fun like instantaneously. Like that's wild. Just a video of a unicorn. Apparently that's a lot of fun. All right, now we need to go to bed. Cause it's bedtime. All right, we're fully rested. And y'all, we are just out about out of time for this video. So thank you so much for joining me for today's video. If you enjoyed it, be sure to give this video a thumbs up, a thumbs up, hit that like button. And, and if you're watching this video and you enjoy what you saw today, hey, we do all kinds of Roblox action. We do other games. We have some try not to laugh. We have Pastor Dylan tries. All kinds of fun and exciting uh, videos and so be sure to check those things out and if you aren't be sure to hit that subscribe button and notify or I guess it's over this way and notification bell uh, so that you can stay updated for when we do post another video because you want to be caught up you want to see the next best thing because we are going to be rolling out some new videos so be sure to stay tuned but again thank you so much for joining me for today's video and I hope to see you in the next one Thank you so much for watching today's video. I don't know if you know this, but you are here on purpose for a purpose. You are not here by mistake or accident, but you are here for a reason. God created you and God loves you so much. In fact, God loves you so much that he did something amazing for you. Do you want to hear about that real fast? If you've never heard about it before, I want to tell you something amazing that God did for you. And so God loves you so much that what he did is he sent his one and only son, his one and only son, Jesus, to come to this world, uh, live the perfect, awesome life, and then suffer on a cross, pay the ultimate price on a cross so that we could have a relationship with God. And you're like, whoa, 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 hold up one second. God loves me so much that he sent his one and only son, Jesus, to come to this world, pay the ultimate price on the cross and suffer. Why? Why would he do that? Like, why did someone have to die for me? Like, what's the point of that? Well, let me tell you, we all have something called sin in our life. Sin is the bad things that we do. It's the, the bad choices that we make. It could be uh, cheating, stealing, uh, lying. These, these are some examples of sin. And so we all have sin. The Bible tells us for all have sin. So we know that sin is in everybody's life. And God is a good God and sin is a bad thing. And so what it does is it separates us from God. It makes it to where we aren't able to have relationship with God. It makes us to where we're not able to be friends with Him.
But God loves us so much that he wants to be our best friend. And so what he did is he sent his one and only son, Jesus, to take our punishment. And so what Jesus did is he came to this world and he was an awesome dude. Let me tell you what, he went around praying for people, uh, getting them healed. He healed people, he set people free, he delivered people from all these incredible things. Like Jesus was awesome. He was a super awesome guy. And while he was here on earth, he then took our punishment. He got beaten on the cross. He got nailed up to the cross, beaten, all kinds of awful things happened to him. And in fact, he ended up dying on the cross. But the story does not end there. Because Jesus, he was buried in his tomb. Three days later, he rose from the dead. He came back to life and he conquered the grave. He conquered death. And in him, we now have victory because he conquered sin. He took our punishment so that we now could have relationship with God, so that we now could become close to God instead of being separated. And so God right now wants to be your best friend. And if you've never asked him into your heart, if you've never accept Jesus' free gift of salvation, because what Jesus did on the cross is he gave us uh, the free gift of salvation. But what, what happens is, is we have to receive that gift. We have to invite him in our heart and confess with our mouth that we believe it happened and that we want to receive that forgiveness. And so what I'm going to do right now is if you have never done that and you want to experience that friendship with God, you want to become best friends with God and discover his incredible plan and purpose for your life. If you want to feel God's great love for you, I want to give you that opportunity today. And so what we're going to do is we're going to say a prayer. And so what I'm going to do is I'm going to say something and I want you to repeat it after me. And so let's go ahead. Part of prayer is we're just going to bow our heads and we're going to close our eyes so that we can show honor to God. And so I'm going to say this prayer and I want you to repeat it after me. Father God, right now, I give my life to you. I confess with my mouth that Jesus is Lord. And I believe in my heart, God, that you raised him from the dead. And that now in him, I have victory. In him, I have the bestest friend I could ever have. Right now, I commit my life to you. I have received Jesus in my heart. Holy Spirit, fill me right now. Guide me, direct me into God's incredible plan for me. In Jesus' mighty name, amen. Amen. All right. If you prayed that prayer for the very first time, I just want you to say that is absolutely amazing. That is awesome. In fact, what's happening right now, they, the Bible says that they are in heaven rejoicing, celebrating, getting super fired up and excited because you are now a part of God's family. And what I want you to do now is I want you to make an effort to get into church. Uh, because what happens is when we go to church, it gives us this opportunity to get to know more about God and to grow closer to God. It, it helps us learn more about God and how we can have that best friendship with Him and how we can walk in His incredible plans for our life. And so get to a church if you aren't going to one already. Go to church, uh, let them know there that you gave your life to Jesus. Or uh, if you're already going to church, whenever you go there, you tell them, hey, I gave my life to Jesus because that is something awesome. That is something amazing. God has incredible things ahead for you. And I am super excited for what he is going to do now that you are open to what he's going to do. Now that you've given your life to him, it's going to be amazing. It's going to be incredible. And so anyways, thank you so much for sticking with us this long. I really hope uh, that you have an amazing, amazing week and I will see you all next time.